Move to Virginia is to say that you don't really, uh, you're not really committed to equity, you're not committed to diversity. In the shadow of aging FedEx field, three members of the Prince George's County Council and former County Executive Rashern Baker, now running for governor, called on Washington Commander's owner Daniel Snyder to keep his money and his new football stadium complex right here in Landover. As WUSA 9 first reported earlier this month, Prince George's County is one of four potential sites for a new Commander's Stadium. The other three are in Northern Virginia, but right now it's Virginia prepared preparing to write the biggest check, with the state legislature nearing approval of a billion dollar bond package to help Snyder finance stadium construction. The financial details of Maryland's plan, which is focused on building FedEx Field's replacement on undeveloped land adjacent to the current site, remain unclear, with Governor Hogan seemingly open to investing hundreds of millions of dollars in development around the new stadium, but opposed to giving Snyder taxpayer dollars to build the stadium itself. There's very few things that uh, Governor Hogan and I agree upon, uh, but that's one. FedEx Field has long been a source of frustration for Commanders fans, with complaints ranging from traffic problems to a lack of access to public transportation. Prince George's County Council member Mel Franklin says area leaders have spent the past 25 years trying to overcome the ill-conceived location for FedEx by investment and development of the surrounding area. So I, I think regardless of whether they stay or go, we will create a tremendous economic destination here. Obviously, if they stay, it's an even better destination. Wherever the Washington Commanders decide to build its new stadium, the team is going to have to make a decision relatively soon. The lease here at FedEx Field only runs for another five years, and it takes about that long to build a new football stadium. In Landover, Maryland, Eric Flack, WUSA 9.